Hey, good morning everyone. This is Madhusudan from James Smith Technology Blog. Uh, you can reach out my blog at jamesmith73.wordpress.com. Uh, today I will be basically trying to create a web center portal, add a couple of pages to the portal and uh, assign a template to the portal. This will be the first part of it. Once we have done that, we will register a couple of users to the portal and then enable them to be able to log in and access this portal. Uh, we will be using Web Center with the latest release that is PS7 11.1.1.8 and uh, let us see how the whole thing is being done. To start with we should ensure that the Web Center portal managed servers are running that is WC Spaces. Couple of other servers that you would need to be running is uh, your admin server. Uh, UCM is our the Web Center content that should be running because this is where you would store all your images and, and any CSS or JS files. WC collaboration this is related to your uh, discussion server. Uh, discussions or announcements all this would be enabled through this. It's an optional you can have it or not have it. But you definitely need WC spaces server to be running. Uh, let me add a point here UCM, WC collaboration, WC spaces all three servers are running as manage servers on top of admin server once the servers are up and running uh, we should be able to see this portal page or uh, welcome login page the goal now is to create a web center portal so let me log in as WebLogic click on administration go to portal stack click on create portal you can select any of the uh, templates but uh, I would prefer the first one just give the name my school you can decide to make it public or private if you make it public any user can access whereas if you make private only the users who have got privileges to this portal can access let me make it as private click on private and create done your portal is created this is my web center portal my school the first thing I would like to do is uh, add a template to this click on edit your portal template edit your portal here you could add a couple of pages or you can change the template but uh, let me go ahead and add a page find new page use this page I just give the name as my docs you can edit the page this is your resource catalog on the right side you can add anything but let me just go ahead and add my document repository okay the problem is you need to enable discussion services we will save this for a while Go to administer portal and in the tools and services we ensure that discussion announcement documents are enabled once we do that we click on the pages go back to the my docs page and click on edit page you should be able to see the documents here fine let me just change the template of this particular portal let me go back to the settings and uh, select a page template I just select James internal template a maroon color background one and just click on save once you have done that you click on view portal you are seeing the blue background you can just change this by changing the skin you can select 
spaces effect skin let's click save view portal that's pretty much it you have your portal up and running the next phase would be to add a couple of users let me log out of this thing let me register a new user John now user John is registered once we have registered a user John he should he would not be able to log in and access let us go ahead and try to access this John tries and welcome one John is unable to log in I still can't see my new portal for John so what I would do is uh, log in as WebLogic and try to give access to this person log in as WebLogic welcome one okay go to administration look for the portals you have my school here click on administration link go to security this is very important here right now only WebLogic is a user that can access this particular portal I would like join John to be able to access this portal I click on this it asks me what role I want to give I would make him participant if I make him moderator he can also go ahead and add pages so let me just make him as a participant click on add that's pretty much it. John has been added to this particular portal, my school. Let me log out and log in as John. Welcome one. I can see my school here. I click on that. John is able to see his portal. And there is also the page that we have created, my docs. He clicks on that, he can see his document folder. Thank you.